hello guys and uh, welcome to our channel and uh, today i will tell you about uh, what were the medical subjects uh, during my mbbs course in romania and uh, i'll tell you in uh, every year which subjects i studied plus i will also tell you about the medical books which i brought from india i have few of them in my library so i'll show you and i'll uh, clear a few of your doubts regarding the medical books so mostly you will uh, get uh, the no medical notes from the medical university here so they are written by the professor some of them are translated from the romanian books and um, but still you will need your english uh, books like uh, Grey's anatomy guide in physiology or video choracy anatomy to clear your doubts it doesn't matter which uh, uh, language you are studying all the medical knowledge is the same so you need to clear your basic doubts and so i brought few books from india and it was really helpful especially for the fmg exam which i cleared so uh, first i will show you the medical subjects the list of the medical subjects which i studied so as you can see here this is uh, for the first year you can see the first year su subjects so starting with anatomy, biochemistry, biophysics, medical informatics, cell biology. You also have a class of Romanian language to interact with the patients. The sports, anatomy and embryology, physiology, biochem, behavioral science, Romanian language and the hospital practice means the summer practice, which you need to do in your summer vacations. Then comes the second year, you can see here. So mostly one year is divided into two semesters. So here they're mentioning all the subjects. So again here, anatomy and biology, histology, physiology, microbiome, virusology, parasitology, methodology, immuno, again, Romanian language, then sports, neuroanatomy, histology, physiology, medical genetics, uh, sports and hospital practice so uh, the sum of vacation is usually for two months in that you need to practice when you go back to India or you can stay here and practice in the hospital so now I'll tell you about the third year subjects so you can see here morphopath so third is, year is really important because here you will start your uh, clinical practice in the hospitals in the first two years, mostly the classes will be in the university. So you can see your morphopath, physiopath, pharmacology, surgical semiology, internal medicine, morphopath 2, physiopath, pharma, semiology, internal medicine, and primary assistance of health condition. Then again comes the summer practice. Here you can see it's fourth year. So fourth year you have hygiene, general surgery, anesthesia, orthopedics, urology, uh, medical labor. So there are some optional subjects also. So I chose ECG, then hygiene, oncology, ENT, radiology, internal medicine, and pneumophysiology, oromaxillofacial surgery and then the hospital practice so these are the fourth year subjects so now comes the fifth year you can see here clinical biochemistry internal medicine endocrinology diabetes dermato plastic surgery history of medicine ophthalmo neurology neurosurgery pediatrics pediatric surgery so interventional imagistics, hospital practice. And finally is the sixth year. Public health, psychiatry, medical psychology. Optional course, you can see their family planning. Then gynecology, legal medicine, infectious disease, epidemiology, balneal therapy, family medicine, emergency medicine, acupuncture. Mostly you saw these uh, subjects and you can make a rough idea and you can compare with the Indian subjects also. So here as I told you it's with the European credit system so every year it has 60 credits. 
so in the end of six years you need to collect 360 credits to get a european diploma so now i'll show you some of my medical books so this is my uh, and Jonas mini library you can see your medical books so this one you can see it's the park preventive and social medicine then comes Nettler, you can see your Nettler's Atlas for anatomy, then Gray's anatomy. So most of the books I bought it from India because here the books are really expensive and it's better to bring it from India or you can get also online. This is for the cardiology, Brownwood heart disease, for ENT. can see the author also Dhingra mostly these books are also used in India you can get it easily over there BD Chorus here then for pathology you can see your Robinson for physiology I was using Guyton and obviously for internal medicine the best book is Harrison you can see your For surgery thus and this was for the USMLE the Kaplan and all then you can see here this is the question bank the success magic this is again for cardiology tips and tricks of cardiology because it's a very important subject everything is connected to the heart ECG. I also took a book for to learn the Romanian language. This is the second edition of the Harrison book. You can see. Cardiology secrets. Medical secrets. You can see your essentials of pharmacology. KD Tripathi. This is Rome's. Then here some books for Yana because she's in pediatrics. You can see this is in the Romanian language. You can see the pediatrics emergency. I brought her a few books from India also. You can see pediatric secrets. This is the question bank. These were our thesis, you can see. This is a forensic medicine toxicology. For gyne, obviously every medical student, they have a pile of books. Ophthalmo. Korana. The question bank of physiology. Gyne, you can see. Brought only for anesthesia. Here, you can see the emergencies and pediatrics. Oxford Handbook. On call x rays. Below books over there also. This is the Oxford Handbook Clinical Medicine. This was for the cardiology. So these Oxford Handbook they are quite helpful when you're in the hospitals. You cannot carry a big book, so these uh, you can handle these books in their pockets. This was the second version. And for the dermatology. Nothing. So 
so I hope you enjoyed my libraries so obviously couldn't imagine I read those books you can see at the back but obviously being a medical student and to become a doctor you need to read all these books so most of them I brought from India but obviously I needed to pay for the extra luggage so if you get a solution you can also bring a PDF format in the laptop if you don't want to carry these books and uh, most of the notes you can get it so to pass the local exams in every semester it's easy over here from the university notes but these books uh, you need to read to gain knowledge and to crack international exams like uh, indian fmg which will be next exam uh, or usmle or mrcp whichever you want to do later on so hope you like my video and uh, if you have any queries do write you can also write on instagram uh, and uh, do subscribe our channel and see you next time